Hi there, I've just got this new program to me, new to me anyway, called um, Toolstar Auto Poster to Facebook. Uh, it's not because I'm using it, not because I want to post heaps of posts to, fa to Facebook groups, but I want to be able to bump up any posts I do make. That's the main reason I'm getting it. You can actually do it to Facebook pages as well. It's a new feature that's just been added. This software's been around quite a few years, so it uh, obviously works. And uh, you have to set it up as an app inside Facebook. It's got full instructions um, here inside this website when you get it. The only thing, the instructions for doing everything else are not terribly clear. So I thought I'd make this quick video showing you how to add groups. Now, there is a feature here where it says go to that this website and just add all your groups uh, in one hit. So when you go to that page, Actually, if you look up here, that's the page they send you to. But now groups in Facebook have been reorganized, and the ones that I am the owner of or the moderator for are in a category, a different category. So when I try to follow these instructions here, you know, right click, save as, and I had the file down there, it wouldn't work. I've tried about four different times. So I've given up that idea now, and I'm just going to gradually add them one by one, my groups. But again, that's uh, a lot more tedious than if you can get that one up there to work, do it that way. You know, it's a two minute job. Here, I have to go and um, find my Facebook group. Now, when I make my groups, I give them all a URL name. I don't just leave them with the number at the end, like this number here that Facebook gives it. Um, for SEO purposes, search purposes, and everything, I actually put the name of the group in there. So now I've given myself a bit of an extra job here. What I have to do, it gives you the instructions here. Open the Facebook, go to the lookup ID. So that page is there that you go to, and then you do the look. I'm going to show you how you do that. So um, there's this group, uh, Dallas, Texas, right? That's the thing that will remind me which one I'm doing now. So I'm going to copy that, and I go over to um, the lookup ID. And I put the name there, paste it into there. Click outside of that so it, it looks at it quicker. Click on the lookup. And there it is. You've got the name of the group and here is the number that you want. So you just double click on that, copy it. I'm doing it with the mouse everything, but I normally use Control V, Control C, and all of those, but I'm, I'll do it with my mouse so you can see what I'm doing. Go back over to here, and this is where you've got to put them. As you can see, <coughs> I've actually already done that one. It's the same as the first one. So I'll get rid of that. I'll just do it once more so you can see clearly how I do it. So that one I've just done. So close that one down. That's the biggest trick is following which ones you've done and which one you haven't. So this one is Phoenix, Arizona. That'll be my clue. Oops. Clue to which one I'm doing. Um, can't put this whole name in it. It seems to cause problems. So I'm just choosing the bit that they want. Actually, no, I'm going to try it again. Let's try. It's so it's because it's so much easier just to do the whole URL. You just double click, triple click, sorry, copy, go to your lookup. Left click, right click, paste, click outside the box, look up. There it is. Double click again, right click, copy. Oops, a daisy. Hit the wrong button. Right click, copy, and back to the auto poster and pop it in there. Hmm, it's longer than the others, so it's weird. Anyway, let's see what happens. So now I'm just going to show you, I'm just going to add these three and show you what happens. You just click, go back up here and click to the add groups. You would expect that little box to be below there, but it's not, it's there. So add new groups, total groups three. Here it comes, it's adding it now. This should increase to six. If it doesn't, 
I've messed it up. Okay, refresh. <coughs> Let's see if it's got. Oh, it doesn't have six. Oh dear, what have I done wrong? Okay, it's a bit glitchy for me. Let me try one more. I should have kept a copy of all of those group IDs. Probably only needed one of those to be wrong to get them all thrown out. Still. I'm sitting here with my laptop on my knee away from the router a fair bit, so the Wi Fi is a bit slow. Sorry. Uh, where are we? Let's just do another one. We'll do this one again. Maybe. Oh, it's that business at the end, I bet. Yep, I'll stick to just doing that part. Right click, copy, and paste. Oh, sorry, forgot that step. This is where I paste. <laughs> See how tedious it is, isn't it? Eh? Click outside of it. Click on the lookup. There's the lookup. Double click, right click, copy. Go back to the auto start poster and put it there. I'm just going to add this one group now. Let's see, add groups. Doing something. Should have four groups there now. See what I mean about it being difficult? It's very contrary. Groups names. Oh, oh, there they are. See how contrary it is. It's, it's not intuitive at all. So you have to go and click on that add the groups again and they're all sitting there and then you click on them. I guess that's because you can choose which group. I, I've only made one group. Glad I did, because if I'd made more than one, it'd be triply difficult. <laughs> so I'm going to now add all of those ones that I've added to, uh, let's see, to the list work from home. That's the only list I've made so far. Save changes. Hooray! Hooray! I've now got six groups <laughs> added. Oh, 10 minutes to do that. Sorry about that, guys. But you can see how tricky and difficult it is. Just got to persevere until you get all your groups. I think it's going to pay for itself in the long run. I'm paying $6 a month for this. Brilliant. Even if it's just the bump up. While I'm here, I'll just show you the bump up. Bump posts. I've only got a post in one group at the moment. I'll just show you how I bump it. I just put a full stop. Or you put anything you like. Anything. Have you seen this? Start comment. Hold on, we're commenting on it. Bang! It's bumped up, back up to the top of the group. So I think that's the best feature of this little auto poster thing. Um, plus, you know, it's got all the other features as well. I might make some more videos later if people are interested. Okay, guys, have fun. See ya.